So the world of artificial intelligence, machine learning, as well as cloud computing and big data is growing exponentially. More and more enterprise organizations that I work with myself as a senior project manager, enterprise architect, and helping these organizations develop solutions based on cloud. Because the only viable alternative left coming in future is actually going to cloud computing and working with machine learning and artificial intelligence, which is, of course, the most growing field at this point in time. And it is going to grow further as we move ahead of time. Welcome to this course on working with AWS machine learning using Jupyter Notebooks. Together, myself and my co-instructor, Sim Shah, we've designed this course specifically keeping in mind the real-world scenario. So let me walk you through the course agenda. In this course, we are going to start off with the basics of what AWS machine learning is. So if you're a beginner, perfect. We're also going to explain the types of machine learning in a manner that is most understandable. And of course, then we are going to apply all of these concepts using Jupyter Notebooks and work with Amazon SageMaker as well. well. Let me backtrack a little bit. So we'll talk about the AWS machine learning concepts such as unsupervised learning, supervised learning, reinforcement learning, working with structured data, unstructured data. So you will get a solid understanding of all of these concepts. And then of course, we're going to take all these concepts and apply them using Jupyter Notebooks and working with code such as Python or Java or any other code. Then we'll get into the Amazon SageMaker, which allows developers to build and train AI and machine learning models so that we can do predictive analysis or other analytical analysis. Who is this course for? We've designed this course for complete beginners as well as some intermediates. So if you are an intermediate user of AWS or other cloud computing technologies such as Azure, you may learn a tip and techniques out of this course. So the ultimate goal is to provide you valuable content working with real world projects and use cases. So it's not just talking about definitions and terms, but actually taking those terms and definitions, concepts and applying in a real world scenario, working hands on using Amazon Web Services. So by the end of this course, you will not only gain valuable skills or maybe enhance your skills and get some valuable content. And this will help you improve your career. Maybe if you're working in projects, you will definitely see this course as being valuable. Uh, we value your feedback. Please feel free to provide your feedback so we can make our courses better and better. Together, we're teaching over 200,000 happy students at Udemy, and we're super excited to bring you these courses. We have over 45 courses so far. So based on our student feedback, we've actually designed this specific course so you can gain some valuable skills. So if you're ready to learn machine learning within AWS, working with SageMaker, working with Jupyter Notebooks, this is the right course for you. I welcome you to this course. What are you waiting for? Click on the enroll button now and we will see you in class.